2018 Hyundai Tucson. I'm finally showing you this Tucson. We've had this Tucson for a little bit. It took us a, a minute to get to it to clean it. I know there's a cus couple customers that were waiting to see this. So here it is. You know, I'm just big on not showing the vehicles until I get it cleaned up, you know? Not that it was super dirty, but it was just, it wasn't up to my level. It was up, up, up. It wasn't up to, how can I say this, to my criteria. I don't know. You know what the word I'm looking for. It just wasn't up to my standard. You know, I wanted it to make it look in this condition. You know, I had to buff it, I had to shine it up, things like that. You know, because white cars always show well, but sometimes they get a little dull, as you can say. You know, sometimes there's um, some imperfection in the paint, or it might be a little stained, this, that. So I had to shine up the car, I had to buff the car out. So I wasn't able to show it earlier, but there it is. 2018 Hyundai Tucson. This is the SEL model. So um, you do have um, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, all the stuff, man. Navigation, backup camera. Um, this one even have heated seats, which is a rarity for cloth seating, but it has it. It has heated seats. It's in great condition, as you can see for yourself. 2018, and it's finally available for sale. Super clean. SCL, again, with all the options. Or it is an all-wheel drive model. So I know that some people really care about that because some of these are not all-wheel drive. So this one is an all-wheel drive model in the SCL model. And it's ready, it's ready to go. 2018. Mm -hmm. This one is being offered by yours truly, showroom model. So as you can see, the car is in great shape. Mm -hmm. From top to bottom. It's in remarkable condition. I'll show you new tires because new tires, you can see for yourself, like even the little nipples. You see the little nipples on the tires are still there. So new tires on this vehicle. Mm -hmm. 2018 Hyundai Tucson SCL model. White with the light gray interior. This, is, this interior is light. You know, for, for those who love light interiors, this is going to work for you really well. For those that are worried about light interior, I don't know, guys. I don't think the kids can come along with this one because cranberry juice. That's going to get in this. I mean, listen, you can always buy the covers. That wraps it up real well. I think even uh, WeatherTech now has a uh, seat covering. So there's a lot of options you have, but uh, if you're just going to leave it like this and you got like a two-year-old, listen, what can I say? You can't get rid of your two-year-old, but um, they, don't gotta get, they, don't have, they don't have to come in the car. You can make up all type of excuse never to bring them along because, trust me, this could make you have a really bad day. Um, Bluetooth, yes it has it. it, has that weird thing, I don't know if it's a man or a woman there, I can't tell you, the Bluetooth symbol, I can't tell you, let's get into focus, I can't tell you what that is man, I don't know if it's a man, I don't know if it's a woman, so we're just going to keep it as the Bluetooth symbol, simple, that's all we're going to do, we're just going to keep it as a Bluetooth symbol, say... Back again. Oh, I don't even know the words. That kind of sucks, right? When you try to sing and you don't even know the words. That's me. I don't know the words. I like the song, but I don't know the words. Mm -mm -mm. So you know what? When you when you have those issues, you don't know the words. Just hum along, <laughs> or just whistle. You know, it's the only way you get away with it. Android Auto, Apple CarPlay. You got all the stuffy stuff, man. Lots of stuff in this thing. Uh, there was something else I saw set up here. Yeah, this phone projection. Whew. Whatever. I don't know what it is, but it means something. So, tons of options here. Oh, so it does have heated seats, which, as I said, is a rarity when it comes to cloth seats, but 
It has heated seats and they get hot immediately. The minute I turn that damn thing on, you hear, you feel it. So it gets hot immediately. There we go. It's a light interior, but we have it in great shape. It's in great shape now. What you do with it, listen man, that's your business. What shape you maintain it in, it's totally your business. It's your car, you own it. But right now it's in, as you can see, it's in great shape. Is it gonna stay in great shape? I don't know. I don't know, but nevertheless, that's your business. That's your business. You decide what you fitting to do with it. It's your car. That's your business. All right, so I got the motor. You, oh my God, that one was heavy. So, GDI. You know, I'm sick of saying I don't know what it is, but I really gotta look this up. But you know the funny thing? Right now, I care about it. As soon as I hang up the phone, as soon as I press stop on the phone, I couldn't care less about it. <laughs> you know, so I know right now, I, right now I'm really curious what GDI stands for, and I really wanna know what GDI stands for right, right now. But the minute I close this hood and I turn off this video, you think I'm gonna lie to you and tell you, yeah, I'm gonna go and research it? Man, I'm gonna move on to the next thing, man. I couldn't care less what GDI stands for. You know, I might as well make up something that it stands for. What could I come up for GDI? Let's see. Good does, nah, it don't make any sense. Um, great discovery. No way, but it has to be something related in relation to engine. Okay, so, ooh, gas distribution injection. That's what it stands for. Absolutely not, it doesn't stand for that, but it sounds great. So, if I was at a party and I wanted to lie about what GDI stands for, like, I want to lie like I know what I'm talking about, I would say, yeah, you know, this, this car has a, a great gas uh, distribution injection, you know, GDI. And a moron that doesn't know any better, We'll be like, oh yeah, 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 yeah. I do know about that um that gas distribution engine. It's a great engine. You know, it's a really, really, really great engine. And we'll be two dumbass morons trying to make up something that we don't know about. So listen, if you're dumb, that's what it stands for. Gas distribution engine. If you're smarter than me, then obviously you know it doesn't stand for that. So then I'm the moron. But if you're not smarter than me, you're the moron. And I know what I'm talking about. Alright? Guys, this is a very nice Hyundai Tucson available for sale come check it out for yourself and i'll show you the gr the gas distribution injection motor <laughs> i'll take care of yourselves guys and i'll talk to you soon bye bye